okay good day so in this video we are going to go over how to log into the meta trader application for the mobile device that's for phone um first and foremost you need to have your meta trader application downloaded on your phone for the android you can get that on the play store or for the iphone user you can get that on the app the app store yes so once you have that all you need to do is have an account usually um you can get an your your broker creates an account for you and they send the login details to your email address so if you check your email address you should have the account details you want to log into this is mine this is mine now um this is the meta trader demo account so i want to log into this demo account all i need to do now is copy the user here hold on these are the two important things i need the user that's the user login one and my password these are the two things i need so i go to the meta trader application and click on the top left corner on the top left corner here so it brings out a dialog box so next thing i want to click on is manage account when i click on manage account now i click on this addition sign here so with the addition sign now i can log into an existing account so i'll click on log into an existing account the same thing applies for the iphone user but at the point where you have to click at the top left you click on the bottom right where you see settings so you log into an existing account now i want to find my broker i am using rally trade so i'll just search for r a l l y t r a d e rally trade demo so there are two servers here there's the rally trade mt4 demo and there is the rally trade real tree in this instance i'll be using the demo since i want to log into a demo account if i were logging into a real account i would select rally trade real but i'm logging into a demo account so i'll select mt4 demo and here i am now so i'll get my details from the mail i'm going to copy the password because my phone is usually very sensitive when it comes to um, logging in or in fact when it comes to security it's very 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 um, sensitive so it's possible it ends my application so i'll copy the password here copy and i'm going to cram or write down the user id you can copy it on your own phone I don't think it will be that much of an issue so i'm back on my mt4 now all i need to do now is impute you see that's taking me out impute the details so i'll just do it again manage account add account log into an existing account select that demo now i'm going to paste my password here paste then i'm going to do the same thing for my um for the login that's the user id this time i'm just going to write it out one one two three two one one two three two seven eight one three one seven eight one three one so now i would sign in I would sign in very good voila i'm signed in now and i'm signed into my new demo account with a balance of 200 i'm very much signed in now so the next thing i want to do is depending on the type of account that was created you want to get the the quotes or the assets that are tradable on them like for instance this euro usd here that is blood out is not tradable i can't trade on you see that there is no option for new order but you see that this one that has a plus here i can trade on it because there is an option for new order so that's because of the account type that i opened but i hope i was able to cover how to log into the mt4 so in the next set of videos you'll be able to get um, how to approach selecting your instruments depending on your account type thank you